Face came on in one minute. Hashtag real. Hashtag not could be. Yo, I forgot to unmute. Gasp when I saw the title? I know, right? I'm finally doing it for the fans. Also because the new Paper Mario comes out in a week and a half. And I actually have the money to buy it. So guys, we're going to be playing... Wait, I shouldn't have been doing the intro yet. <laughs> hi, Keelan. Hi, Mac. Can we get some yos? Hi, Kim. Hello, everybody. I'm live early. And also, I didn't finish my breakfast. Today, I went shopping. You know, women be shopping, so I got myself sushi. And it's like, 
kind of bad, but kind of good. You know what I mean? Hi, guys. I gotta finish this. I love the Paper Mario on the Wii. Dude, I begged my mom to buy this shit, and she never did. So you know what? As an adult, I'm gonna buy whatever the fuck I want. No, I swore! We're six minutes in, we're good. You divod, you're safe. Me and Kim came in like a bunch of bananas. <laughs> what? what does that mean? What the hell? Also, I mailed out everybody's sketch cards this morning. So that hopefully everybody should get them by Friday. Um, I'm gonna take some sushi. I'll have one bite. So! <laughs> so! So I got an email. Okay. So this weekend, I took it off because it was holiday. Before anybody asks, no, I did not see my mother. <laughs> How was my sister's potluck? Oh my god, that was so drama. Not really though. So, I was a little bit annoyed because my friend came over for the weekend. So my friend got here at like 10 and we were going to go out to like a, a lunch slash dinner at 2. But then I was like, shit. I have to help my sister make her food, so, and it took us about an hour and a half to make all the musubi and the curry, and which both came out really good, really bomb, and so we made that. I posted the curry on my Twitch story, but then I was such in a rush because we had to go, we had to catch a bus, like right, right after we finished doing the musubi, I had like five minutes to get ready to go out to eat, so I'm like, shit, so I'm like, <laughs> rushing, changing super quick so I can catch the bus on time. And that's a whole other story about, I got another email, about um going out to eat, which I will tell on the next Mario Kart stream, which will be, um, I don't know. I don't know when I'm doing Mario Kart again, but I, I'm like prepping how I'm going to like script out the little story. Hi, Archie. I saw you followed last night. Thank you. Can we get some yo's? Hello, new chat, everybody. Be nice. Also, we get free emotes. Holy shit. Wait, I swear. I need to stop swearing. So anyway, you guys will hear the restaurant story next time we play Mario Kart. So make sure you're following and subscribe. That way you can watch it. Um, so that was Saturday. Can't wait to start watching daily? Ain't no way. Hi, Archie. You know what? We need a new dedicated fan, and I think you match the ticket. No description. Okay, so that was Saturday, and then Sunday, I just played video games by myself. Oh my god. So, I'm, like, so close to having my supermarket simulator store, like, fully maxed out. I have, like, four more store upgrades, and then two more business licenses. But I do have it fully, like, leveled out. So, I played a lot of supermarket simulator yesterday, and then I edited. Guys, talking about editing, new YouTube video. It's in the pinned chat. Also... Click the link, go watch it later. It is called Making a Bouquet for Your Mother. It's a banger video. What else? Yeah, so that was this weekend. I rested, I chilled with my friend. And I will tell the restaurant story. When we play Mario Kart, let me just say, I almost cried. <laughs> no, I didn't. <laughs> Wait, I almost kind of did. Okay. So plan is simple today. We're playing a super, super paper Mario. But before that, I saw this at the shop today. Have you guys seen this? Calypso Kiwi Lemonade. I know it's flipped. Just like, pretend it's flipped in your head. I walked into Winko and literally the first display had like eight different flavors of the Calypso Lemonade. And I was like, holy shit. I've never seen this one. Is this one new? Granted, how much sugar is in here? Oh my god. <laughs> um, pretend it's flipped. Servings per container, one serving, so 16 ounces. 108% of your daily value sugar. Oh my god. I'm gonna be zooted today. Holy shit. I don't know, because like, I allow myself like two sugary drinks a week, because when I went to the dentist, they were like, how many sugary drinks do you have between meals? And I'm like, two a week? 
Sometimes. Yeah, we're gonna try this live, everybody. You ready? Wait, am I supposed to shake it? I'll shake it. It says shake well. I love those. They're so good. I know. I love lemonade or any type of juice that has pulp. It makes me feel healthy. Guys, get ready for the ASMR. Ooh, did that come on on the mic? I was just a, this is like one of my favorite shades of green. It looks a bit darker on camera, but it's like a seafoam green, which if you cannot tell is my chat color, so therefore it's my favorite. Okay, first sip. Wait, it smells like strawberry kiwi juice, like Kool-Aid. It doesn't taste like kiwi. It smells like fake kiwi. It just tastes like a lemonade that has more sugar in it. It's not sour, it's like super sweet. Um, I feel like I got clickbaited 7 out of 10. But you know, I'm gonna keep sipping on it for the rest of the day. And because I'm sophisticated, I'm gonna drink it out of my one of the four remaining glasses we have in the house. I just haven't had a chance to go to Goodwill and buy more. Because I don't feel embarrassed, like, taking the bus. But, like, imagine getting your Goodwill haul with all your little trinkets and shit on the bus. I love the red and the blue Calypso. The blue one? Oh, no, I love the one that's, like, the... It's, like, a purpley blue. The sunset one. That one is banging. Okay, enough stalling. I've yapped for ten minutes. Do we have any final words before we play this silly little game? We gotta do our YouTube intro, too. I've done that before. I always feel so embarrassed. Like, I always go grocery shopping and I take the bus home. And I have, like, my two big-ass bags. And I feel embarrassed. But it's, like, no, it's not too big a deal. I don't know. I'm just a classist at heart. Okay. Everybody, we're gonna play the game now. So, you know the drills say hi, you two. How am I gonna do the intro for this? Should I mute the music? No, it's fine. Okay. The new Paper Mario is coming out May 23rd, so about a week and a half away. So, for the next few days, I'm gonna be playing through Super Paper Mario on stream. Holy moly, this is my first ever Paper Mario game. I never had the chance to play it because one of the rules my parents had was if we were gonna buy a game, both my sister and I have to want it. I wanted this game so bad, but my sister didn't want it. So, as an adult, I finally bought it. I think I, I got it at GameStop, which I don't buy games from GameStop anymore because, you know, support local, but also it's cheaper at like local stores. So I think I got this for like $28. And it was really funny because it had two, like, resale stickers on it. And I peeled off the first one, and originally it was selling for 30 So you know what? I got $3 off. So, allegedly, this game is 18 hours long. 50 hours if you want to do 100%. Which, I'm not gonna do. I'm sorry, Nintendo fans, I'm not doing that. How many hours do we have on the piece? Like, like 105? <laughs> so... <laughs> We're gonna play through this game and see how long it takes me. Okay. Intro done. <laughs> I don't know who's gonna edit this stream. Hopefully it's not me. I'm trying to think. No, I don't think there's anything else I need to address. Let's play Paper Mario. You guys wanna- Okay, that save file was just to test audio. That's not like my secret file, don't worry. Super Paper Mario, everybody. And yes, wrist strap is going on because I am still accident prone. Uh, let's make a new game. Actually, I'm going to choose the green file because I love green. Eight character slots. Also, the game is slightly cropped to fit a 1080p resolution. So I had to crop off like 20 pixels from each side. Hopefully it doesn't affect it too much. Ain't no way a tier 2 sub? Holy! You know what? I'll say it? Shit. Thank you, Vic. Can we get some Wicketons in chat? Guys, I think Vic is a secret simp. They're my only tier 2 sub. Thank you, Vic.
Oh, the lemonade is like kind of bad. <laughs> Sorry. Simp is my middle name. Vicodent Simp. Wait, you, you should make something funny with your fake initials. Okay. Wait, I can put little emoticons? Let's see. Too bad there's not a peace sign. Actually, I don't want the star. Should I piss everybody off? Just make my first letter lowercase. Type one if you're gonna be triggered the whole playthrough. <laughs> I played this game last year, it's really good. Um, no spoilers, you get banned. You know what? You guys always give me slack for having like a full lowercase name. I'm doing this. And I'll be honest, I'm doing this to like farm chat. There we go. Use this name. Oh no, I misclicked! I didn't mean to! <laughs> I didn't mean to press two! That was an accident! That was gonna be a bit! Shit! <laughs> Ever be quiet? The movie is playing. Wow, sure is peaceful today, eh, bro? Makes a guy feel lucky having a peaceful day. Yep, re peaceful. Maybe it's because your name is Peason. It's so peaceful. It's almost a little bit boring. It makes you just want to curb bluey, you know? Some kind of shocking event. Oh, oh at Princess Peach's place, maybe. That'd be cool, huh, bro? Maybe we should go visit Mushroom Castle. It has been a while. I'm sure the princess would be happy to see us. As will you later, Mario. Oh, that's Toad. Mario, help! Toad? What? What happened? Why are you so crazy? Oh my god, this game is not woke. He called Toad crazy. Guys, you know what you have to do. It's sh sh shocking! Mushroom Castle raided! Princess Peach stolen! What? Why, that's ridiculous! Who in the world would do such a thing? I wonder... I Mario wonder. Wait a second. Yeah, I think I've got it. Bro, this must be the work of that guy. That bad guy. Hmm. I won't stand for this. We'll have to sneak into the castle and rescue Princess Peach. Let's go, bro. I right, Toad's face. Wait, can I do it? I, I'm trying to do like a half up, half down. I used to be able to do it. Yes, this is the Wii Paper Mario. I have a Wii remote. Also, Keelan, you can spoil as much as you want, but the first time you do it, you get banned forever. So like, weigh your cards out. <laughs> We're counting on you, Mario Bros. He should have put a question mark at the end. <laughs> Not B -B -B Bowser! <laughs> Listen well, my elite minion task force. Isn't Bowser supposed to be yellow? I, no, isn't he yellow? Did he get a tan? It's time to an. It's time to initiate my awesome plot to invade Mushroom Castle. Today is the day that I make my beloved Princess Peach all mine. And if that weren't awesome enough, I'll also stomp her little mustache buddies. Yeah! Oh, wait, that's you guys. Ah, poor 
under attack. <laughs> you jokers are the best. Hey, who are those hairy guys in the back? We shave around here, minions. It's confirmed. Bowser likes clean shaven. Bruh. Wait, was he just, just like throwing up? What? <laughs> Mario. And Luigi. How'd you get in here? Wait, actually, how'd they get here so fast? Is this- are we, like, speedrunning? What? My front gate was open. How many times have I told these idiots? If you're the last in, lock the gate. Quiet, you- oh. Quiet, you big Bowser. We know you kidnapped Princess Peach. Now where'd you put her? Red Eye, wait, what? We're only, we're only now about to launch our attack. Uh, Mario, help! Princess Peach. <laughs> what voice should I give him? Like, <laughs> your princess has been taken by. Count Black. You. Wait. By who? <laughs> He's who megalolling him. By me, Count Black. The chosen executor of the Dark Prog. No stickers is Count Black. The fine fellow prophecies. Pro prophesies? Prophecy? Shut up, Meg. Mods, you know what to do. The fine fellow pros pro The fine fellow prophecy to come to this dimension is also Count Black. I'll tell you who doesn't make even a little bit of sense, Count Black. Enough. Release Princess Peach right now. I'm on a schedule over here. Count Black says it. This princess is integral to fulfilling the prophecies. She will be brought to Castle Black and used to destroy all worlds by Count Black. Destroy all worlds. Wait, no! Oh, saved. <laughs> Big bro! This man deserves ridicule. Weaklings cannot face Count Black. Hey, here's a thought. You calm down and free the the princess right now. <laughs> Your princess shall not be returned by Count Black. In fact, Bowser, evil king of the Koopas, Count Black will take you too. <laughs> Black. He's like a Pokemon, just keep saying his own name over and over and over. No! This is why I'm scared of black holes. <laughs> black! Count Black's preparations are now in order. All that remains is for the Dimensional Void to appear, as foretold in the prophecy. <laughs> <laughs> no. Mario. Mario. And they all died. And we have a Navi in this game. Okay, what voice should I do? I kind of like the, the... Should I do the peace in bot? Wait, I kind of like that. Are you awake? My name is Tippy. I am what is known as a pixel. A sort of fairy. Mario, I came to find you. Oh, he's really mad. You see that? I am no enemy. Yeah, they're rainbow. That means they're kind, right? You met Count Black, and he captured a princess and an evil king. Is that not so? 
then that means Count Black is even now beginning to form the void. We haven't much time. You must come with me. Yes, if your friends are to be saved. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'll start over. Yes. I can't. I can't. I need some water. <laughs> I need a minute. Oh my. Dude, I hate. I hate seeing the word CO, I mean. But I just can't. I can't do anything else when I see it. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> yes. If your friends are to be saved, you must come. Let us go. And we're in. Oh, ho, oh, well, well, well. Back so soon to be. And who might this be? Red shirt, blue overalls, and a magnificent stash. Dippy, you truly have outdone yourself. He matches the description of the hero in the light prognosticus perfectly. And his name is Mario. Welcome you, Mario. This is the town of Flipside. You have come far from the Mushroom Kingdom of your dimension. Of course, our fair Flipside is in no dimension at all. No, it is between dimensions. My name? I am a descendant of the ancients who created this town. I wait, he has generational wealth. He's a Nepo baby. Yeah, for now, Animal Crossing is on hiatus because it has my name in it. I <laughs> It has my name in it. I can't change my character's name. You know what? When I hit Twitch Partner, I'll play Animal Crossing every day. For the fans. But yeah, for right now, Animal Crossing is just like uh, YouTube content for now. <laughs> yeah, my, my Animal Crossing character is my real name. <laughs> So, like, I can't change it. They should really, like, allow us to change it. Oopsie. <laughs> ah! You want to know about the end of our worlds? What's happening, you ask? So, Tippy has not yet told you, I gather. Well then, Mario, the answer hangs above you. Do you see that gathering darkness in the sky? Okay, I love how it zoomed in and it's still, it's still like as pixely. <laughs> it is the whole of the very dimensional fabric of space. Such a strange phenomenon. It is, is it near or far? No, no. It may appear small now, but it will only grow. And in the end, it will swallow all existence, all worlds, all dimensions. The void was created by our enemy, Count Black. Who wields the dark prognosticus? A fair and lovely princess, a furious monster king. The union of these two will call forth the chaos heart, the consumer of worlds. Wait, do we like it? No spoilers, but do we get to actually smash Peach in this game? And the Chaos Heart will ravage the sky, and so bring forth the Void. Yes! The passage Tippy just quoted is from the Light Prognosticus of my ancestors. The book also says this. The Void will swallow all. Not can stop it, unless the one protected by the Dark Power is destroyed. The hero with the power of eight pure hearts will rise to their task. So it is written. I hope so. <laughs> Me too, man. Me too. <gasps> the Powerpuff Heart. 
this is one of the eight pure hearts. You are surely the hero spoken of in the pages of the Light Prognosticus. You are the only one who can defeat Count Black and save all worlds. Mario, take this and save all worlds from destruction. You know, I've done so much saving in my time. I literally just came from the most peaceful day of my life, as Luigi said. I don't know if I can do this, big man. What? How can you refuse? If you do not accept this, all the world will laugh. You must. I don't want to, sir. After all I have told you, you still refuse. You are our very last soap. Wait, what did I say? Hope. Oh, the very last hope. This is the final time I will ask you. Please, save the world. Guys, I'll run a poll. What should I do? What would you do? Save or soap the world? Nope. Guys, go vote in the poll. Use your democratic right. Oh, I gotta find my poll overlay. Guys, will you save the world? Vote in the poll, use your democratic right, are you gonna save the world? Oh wait, also, I forgot to tell chat earlier, but my friend gave me the mouse finally. And you know what's cool? There's a game mode, holy shit! <laughs> but it also kills the battery, and it's really distracting. The mouse is really heavy, though. It's their old gaming mouse. Why is everybody voting no? Do you guys hate humanity? Yeah, <laughs> true, it is gamer mode. Also, it's 11-12, make a late 11-11 wish. No way! We had zero soap the world. Okay, I have to listen to chat. You guys wanted to say no. Let's see how mad he gets. <laughs> what if he just, like, kills our ass? He's like, if you're not gonna save the world, then, uh, we'll just take you out now. Still no, sir. Oh, he's sad. I see. Then all worlds are as good as doomed. Oh. <laughs> no way. Do I have to start over? Oh my god! That's insane! <laughs> From editor, just cut the next 20 minutes. Holy shit! Take you up before the world ends? I cannot believe I have to start over! I cannot! Guys, get cozy. You know what? My speedrun is now ruined. It's a good thing I don't have my live split on screen. I can't believe it! You guys did this to me! I was not gonna say no in the final one! I was gonna be nice. And this is why I hate democracy. You know what else I hate? People who watch the channel but like don't click follow, guys. Cause we're, we're, we're 30 minutes in the stream, so if you're here and you're lurking, click follow. I will like say hi to you. And if you're already following, make sure notifications are turned on, that way you don't miss a single stream. Because if you aren't following, you're gonna miss, like, banger shit like this. Playing the whole game again. Dude, I, I literally can't skip any of this. I can't pause either. They really made you pay for choosing and not save the world. You know what? I was gonna say something along the lines of that too. And if I would have had this experience as like an eight year old when this game came out for me, I would be like an even nicer person than I am now. I'm at like a 99% nice person, but if I would have had that ending as an eight year old, 
I would have been a 100% nice person. My sushi. The audio isn't synced? Oh, really? Let me check. The audio is very unsynced. I'll better. Thank you for telling me, Cuban. Guys, tell me if the audio just, like, shits itself. What's a wee? I don't know. <clears throat> Hi, Ethan. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Well, VOD Watcher's no longer in shambles. I swear, it's like synced at the starter stream. I don't know what happens. I can't like skip or fast forward anything. At least I can finish my breakfast now. I game over, so I have to do it again. <laughs> The holding B doesn't do anything. Emulate it and make a save point? No! Emulating is illegal and I will never do it. Wink. No, I game over before I got to a save point. Oh, gone. I'm adding a chat timer to remind you guys to tell me if it's decent. There we go, the timer's enabled, so just remind me if anything is sus. Hi Kyle, can we get some yo's? Hello. This game is okay. <gasps> guys, we have a Mario hater in chat. Still say hi to him though. Can we get some yo's for Kyle? What if this game is, like, actually horrible and you guys are all lying to me? You know... April 1st passed already. You guys can't, like, do jokes anymore. I'm not saying that there should be a purge, but I think there should be, like, 
a day where it's like allowed to do pranks and you don't get like canceled for it. Huh? Thank you for the gifted sub, Alex. Can we get some Waluxes in chat? Thank you. I went to Ethan. Why? Ethan's supposed to give me his prime sub. Shoot. Thank you, Alex. Wait, Alex, you got five gifted for the month. Alex, if you want a sketch card, you can get up to two. Thank you. I'm a Mario fan, but this game is unique. Wait, is unique like a bad word? <laughs> I already used my prime sub? Shit. Oh, I got- Oh, yeah, you- <laughs> Wait, I'm not gonna say it. Oh, wait, I'm almost where I was before. I'm not gonna reset. Thank you, Alex. You're gonna get your name written at the end of stream. I don't know. I'm pointing it at my head. I don't think the motion control works this way. It's up to you to decide. I like RPG games, and I know there's, like, RPG aspects to this. I really love Super Mario RPG, though. I did, like, 100% it, basically. So, I don't think there's anything else I can do for Super Mario RPG. I'm probably still gonna hold onto the game, though. I'm not gonna sell it. Or return it. No! Oh! I, I will! I will save the world! I, I skipped it, I'm sorry. I'm gonna save the world! Excellent! You truly are the hero of the Book of Legend! My eyes never, my eyes never deceive you! So... <laughs> Mario, our brave hero, take this! Oh. You got a pure heart. Why, thank you. Okay, I don't like the word choice here. The pure heart has been thrust into- <laughs> The pure heart has been thrust into your possession. Now, great hero Mario, your first task awaits. You must take this pure heart. You must place it in the heart pillar in this town. Tippy will lead you there. Return to me when you are through with this task. This way. When the arrow pad appears, press the red direction on the arrow pad to examine things or talk to people. Finally, we're playing the game. How many minutes in? Guys, we're like 30 minutes in. <laughs> okay. It's not my favorite Paper Mario game, but it beats Paper Mario Sticker Star. That... Sorry, the acronym for that is PMSS. <laughs> How did you lose to a cutscene? I didn't lose, chat made me lose. Chat made me choose the wrong answer. You know, I think you guys did it to just like extend my stream hours for this month, and you know what, I kinda love that. <laughs> she just likes blaming us. No, literally go back in the VOD. Nobody wanted me. Literally zero people voted for me to save the world. Also, I'm broke, boy. I have zero coins. Tippy will guide you to the heart pillar where you must place the true heart. Now be on your way, young hero. I thought it was gonna game over. The heart pillar is this way. Come on, please. Okay, you guys know how I operate in RPGs. I don't like doing the main story, so you know what? I'm gonna go to the right. I think I got kidnapped. I got Mario napped. Flip side, second floor. Wow, you look really silly. Where are you from, mister? It says you. I want to go inside the church. Or maybe it's a greenhouse? 
Holy! Hello! <laughs> Welcome to the Fortune Teller's Fortress. My name is Merlily. I use the twinkling of the stars to help people find the path to happiness. If you pay just a few coins, I will tell you the path you need to follow next. One fortune will cost you precisely five coins. Would you hear it? I am broke boy. It is very much not in the church. <laughs> ah, I see. Your fortune does not interest you, so then be on your way. I I'm broke boy. I literally have zero coins. Whoa, that transition is trippy. Hmm, this town's so peaceful. If you ask me, that's all you can really ask out of life. Very real and true. Oh, hello there. Is this your first time in Flipside? We don't get many visitors, so I'm ever so glad I got to meet you. Take care. Everybody here is so nice. I'm not used to this. Everybody's like so mean to me. Hello. Welcome to Tinga's Inn, where you can recharge your batteries in just one night. Tell me, wary traveler, wouldn't you like to get a good night's rest? Oh, it will amaze you to be sure. Your aches and pains will just melt away. It's five coins a night. How does that sound? I'm broke. I'm sorry. Return to us one day. Heart. Oh my gosh, she loves me. Whoa, it's so weird seeing like the, the 3D graphic of the fan. I'm gonna pause. Important things? I have no Okay, I have nothing important. I can't manually save. Uh oh. You ask and you shall receive. Hit this block to save all of your progress. That way, if your game ends, you can start from the last save point. You'll see these blocks all over the place. Use them wherever you see them. Do you want to save? Yes, I do not want to game over again. Save complete. A no save run. I'm not doing that. I'm sorry. I'm playing this for the fans, but not for like the psychopathic fans, okay? Ah, I forgot the elevator was scheduled to be serviced right now. What a pain. I was gonna have lunch at Saffron's place, but I guess I just have to wait now. If you think about it, there are elevators but no stairs. What were they thinking? You know what? I hate stairs, but it makes sense to have stairs because you know, like, if there's a fire. A hole in the sky? What are you talking about? I can't even deal with the holes in my socks. You want me to care about a sky hole? He's a conspirator. I think he's a flat earther. Wait, it, wait. In his perspective, the world is literally flat. Good day. How's it? Hi, good. Lucky you finding how's it shop here in Flipside. First time here, eh? I had to tell you. We offer shop points here for our regular customers. You earn shop points with every purchase. Limit to one point for every purchase. Earn enough and you win a free gift. Free stuff for free. <laughs> That's good. Want to know just how many points you saved up? Just ask me. Got that? Or do you want to Or do you want to hear my spiel again? I think I got it, sir. Every single shop has a rewards program now and I think it's dumb. All they do is track information and sell to private companies. So you know what? Getting a free lemonade is great and all, but you don't need it. You don't need it. Why is it always flat earth round earth? Where are my fellow plane earthers? I think they were flying the planes. Did somebody say free? Yes, sir. What do you need? Pick up. I don't think I need anything, sir. I'm broke. Oh, he's so polite. He tipped his hat. 
Thanks for clocking in, Kyle. <laughs> that will go on your report. Clocking in late. Did I go in here? I don't think I went in here. Merlin is out. Oh, we just saw Merlin earlier. I believe this was the elevator. Elevator out of order. Do not use. Flip side maintenance crew. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Just make sure you clock it on time next time. Next time will be a write-up. Anyway, if I wanted a hole in the sky, I would just wink at the flight attendant. Yeah, you better be hawing yourself. What the hell? <laughs> I can't. Wow. The elevator. Where am I going? Oh, wait, I'm supposed to, I was supposed to go this way. I was busy with, I was busy with uni, so I was late. Don't worry about it. Bro, I'm goofing. I'm just trolling. <laughs> Dude, imagine if I banned everybody who didn't watch the stream. That would be crazy. Like, I have, like, a few bits for streams, and one bit that I have written down for forever is ban anybody who types in chat for one stream. But then, I would have no chatters, and everybody would get mad. It's one of those ideas where, like, it sounds fun for, like, two seconds, and then in practicality, it's dog shit. I really like the one Doug Dog stream, where he had, like, a little AI bot have like secret rules so if you broke a secret rule you get banned for a day that was a pretty good concept but you know i'm not a stem girly in that way okay i'm stalling too much i need to play the game what am i looking for i, li I like totally forgot what i need to do Can I- I want to talk to my little butterfly friend. That one goes back up. That's how I got here. Oh yeah, I fell down. Flipside third floor. Oh. I missed the floor. Oh yeah, because I went up here, but then I went immediately down because I was like, this is not right. Okay, I got it. I got it now. I don't need the walkthrough yet. Hey, you notice anything about that weird black stuff in the sky? It looks kind of scary, but I don't know what it is. Yeah, you're a child. You know nothing. Enjoy that naivety, child. Weird thing in the sky. Wasn't there yesterday. Did a cloud blow up? Heh. <laughs> what am I talking about? If a cloud blew up, we'd be wet, right? Yeah. I guess. <gasps> this is the heart pillar. Now get close and place the pure heart. Well done. Now, let's return to Merlin. Okay, that was easy. I hope the rest of the game will be this easy. <laughs> I never crouched. I 
I swear the void is getting bigger and bigger. I'm still a brokey, no coins. Perhaps you should strike this block before we head back to Merlin. Okay, that is actually a good idea. With my track record, I need to save as much as I can. And we're in. return look a door has appeared this dimensional door was made to lead the hero to another pure heart yes store lies one of the seven other pure hearts Sippy, you must use your power to help Mario find this pure heart and return here of course and Mario I have something to give you that will aid you on your journey a candy cane. You got a return pipe. A magic pipe that returns you to the flip side from afar. With this, you will be able to return to flip side from an With this, you will be able to return to flip side from anywhere in the universe. Use this whenever you feel you must return in a hurry. To use your return pipe, just go to the important things on the menu screen. Just remember that in some areas, the signal from flip side might not reach. Okay, he said anywhere. He lied. The light prognosticus foretells that the hero will make. The light prognosticus foretells that the hero will meet a dimension governor, and from him, the hero will learn the dimensional technique. I am almost certain this refers to my friend, the flip wizard Bestobius. So go now through this door and seek out Bestobius. Well, let's get going. Still a brokey, not getting paid for my work. I hate capitalism. You know what else I hate? Running ads, but you know what? I have to do it, because we are an hour into stream, so it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing. For $4.99, just $5, skip your coffee and get ad-free viewing all month long. Or, you can link the Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe, see if you got a sub available, and if you're new here and you're lurking, click the follow button. It's free to follow, but $5 to subscribe. Okay, get some water, get a snack. I'll see some of you guys in a few. Man, we're an hour in. 17 hours left. I can probably crank this game out in like maybe six streams. Two if I'm like speedrunning, one if we're doing a subathon. Guys, can we make this a subathon? <laughs> no. I have to make dinner tonight. Oh, the butterfly is sitting on my head. That's so cute. And we're in. <gasps> the void has been ripped into the dimensional fabric. Yes, Count Black is pleased. All has gone as foretold in the Dark Prognosticus. Now it is just a matter of time until all worlds meet their demise. But well, that's just super count. Yeah, first you'll erase all these naughty worlds, and then you're gonna build a perfect world without war and all that other icky stuff. Yes, yes, no one likes icky stuff yet. It's a perfect world. Sounds magical. <laughs> I can hardly stand the wait. Oh, sorry, I'm late. What in 
blazing bog rats! How'd it be myself here? What's going on? <laughs> oh, oh, Chonks, you big silly. Did you oversleep or something? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> I guess it's kind of hard to be on time, though, when you've got muscles instead of brains. Hey. Yeah, you can't fool me with that crazy shape shifting hooliganry. It's Mimi, isn't it? Show a little respect for the Count. He can't go a bar on its face, lass. <laughs> How delightful, Mimi. Almost as dapper as Count Blah. No! Peach is a fan! Oh, golly, thanks, Count. With you around, it's nothing but big smiles all the time. Hanging out with the Count? That's my idea of a perfect world. Heart. And here I thought Mimi's ideal world was a gem-filled pool with hunky lifeguards. Hey, Dementio, have you been reading my diary? I mean, um, never mind. <laughs> well, different strokes for <laughs> Dude, what was going on when this game came out? Oh my god. Well, different strokes for different minions. After these rotten worlds are ended, Count Black will make all your dreams come true. But for that to happen, you must follow the instructions of the Dark Prognosticus. Um, yeah, about that. Just an FYI, I got an urgent memo from your inbox. Apparently, there's been some unapproved interdimensional activity lately. Yeah. I'm thinking it's the Hero of Prophecy. We're gonna need an action plan for this guy. A dimensional interloper! Impossibly the hero! You are sure a bit nasty, see ya? Interesting news, Count Black. We must put an end to this nuisance. Count Black! Let me get this right in me brain. That arrow nasty is going on about. Hey, you're in me. Then you gotta cut me loose on him. You gotta. I'll give him a nice taste of old chunks. Very well, old chunks. I'll leave the arrow chucking to you. Do not fail, Count Black. You can count on me, Count. I'll rain down like a fat thunderstorm, I swear it. Mimi? Dementio? You should tag along. You can witness a proper chunkin'. Hmm, I do enjoy a good chunking. Well then, I believe we'll head out as well. <laughs> so, hero, you would defy Count Black? Then hurry, for your world's end draws near. <laughs> Black. The enemies are so quirky. Mario was called once upon again to save the world. No small task. Could he prevent Count Black from pulling off his sinister plot? Would Mario reunite with Princess Peach? A truly, a truly interdimensional adventure was about to begin. Chapter 1-1 The Adventure Unfolds Finally, a title card. My goodness. I feel the pure heart, but it's still far from here. Merlin told us to find his friend, Bestovius, to learn that dimensional technique. We'd better go find him. One more thing. If you want to learn about anything, just use my power. I know about many things. Simply point your Wii Remote at the screen and Tippy will focus on where you point. Then just press A over anything framed in red to hear more about it. Feel free to ask Tippy about anything or anyone you want. Is she God? 
An hour in and we're finally on the first chapter? You know, I like to take my time. Okay, Goombas, minus one. Plus one! Oh, finally, no more Broke Boy! Oh, that was weird. Okay, I'm pointing with Tippy. <laughs> Wait, this is like I'm lined up to blast Mario. <laughs> Point at yourself, and I will give you advice on what you need to do next. Right? The first thing we should do is find Bestovius and learn how to flip. To flip? My shit? I know how to do that already. But that, that, okay, that is very nice that if you- there is a way to figure out your objective. I really do appreciate that. Okay, B is crouch. Ain't no way. This is a mushroom. Grab these to recover HP. Plus 10? Wow. I wanna get on top. Yup. Why are there equations in the background? I'm out of college. I don't need to be doing math anymore. Okay, I can't be best by a single Goomba. Even even though I have I have game over it already. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll I'll get it. See, I can do it. That takes two hits. We're in. Ooh, secreto. You got a shroom shake. A healthy drink. Restores 10 HP and cures poison. The audio isn't synced again? Uh-oh. Ain't no way. Okay, well, I'll fix it again. Hmm. I don't know how... Ooh. You know what it is? I didn't see if my OBS was updated this morning. Uh-oh. Well, I'm gonna reset both my capture cards and go from there. But thank you, Keelan. Thank you for the follow! Thank you! Also, I have to fix my overlay. Oops. Why isn't that- <laughs> Dude, I hate mod views sometimes. There we go. Okay, I fixed it. Okay, now we're gonna see if the audio is synced.
I forgot to unmute. Okay, so every single hour, because it seems like the capture guard just hates me today, I'll have to check the audio. So every ad break, I'll just check the audio and reset the capture card if need be. If not, anybody who's watching live, tell me if it's unsynced again. If it's more than the two second delay, then the capture card is glitching again. It's probably just capturing from the Wii U, that's why. It's having more difficulty, but it's okay. We're in. Are we trespassing? There's nobody here. This is not an empty house. There's something in this room. I can feel it. I can help you find hidden things. Why don't you use my power to look around? <gasps> Wait, that's kind of cool. There's a hidden door here. Let me make it visible for you. Oh yeah, I guess it makes sense lore-wise, because we're like in between dimensions, so like we don't know if any of this is real. It's a door. Let's go inside. Hmm? What is this meager mustache that stands before me? to address my multicolored glory. How did these flimsy whiskers detect my secret door? Wait right there. Red shirt, conspicuous white gloves, jaunty cap. <laughs> you are garbed in the right cloth of the hero of the prophecy. You must be the great hero impersonator. What a costume! You look like you leaped out of the pages of the prognosticus! This is Mario. He's dressed like this because he is the hero. Merlin told us to find you. Merlin? Oh, his full body beer rivals my hairy magnificence! If Merlin thinks you are the true hero, you probably are. I think. Well then, as the ancient prophecy foretells, I, Bestovius, will bestow upon you the ancient secrets of dimensional flipping for a nominal fee of 10,000 coins. But that is preposterous. You can't charge to teach the hero of the prophecy. Why not? Even the great and spendiferous Bestovius has certain expenditures. Why should the hero get the world delivered to him on a well-garnished platter? These heroes think they can get away with shaking people down for free skills. Wait, I think this guy's a socialist. <laughs> a mere 10,000 coins should be nothing for a hero of the universe. What do you say? I don't have the money, man. That's why I'm saying no. I'm sorry. I see. So be it. I will settle for just taking all the coins in your pocket. Do we have a deal? Yeah, I got five bucks. Take it. Skin to licking. Let us begin. Flip out. <laughs> Wait, did he make me gay? <laughs> I, Stovius, have granted the ability to flip between dimensions. Press A to slip between the very fabrics of space and flip between two and three. Well, what do you think? Mind blown. What is this A I speak of? I assure that if we are being watched from another dimension, these beings will understand. But you lack the mustache for full comprehension. 
Just remember that you can use this ability to find hidden items in secret paths. But beware! Use your new ability too long and you will lose HP! That's kind of a bummer. Use the flip ability to flip into 3D. Flip between 2 and 3D to get through tricky situations and find secrets. While you're flipping, the flip gauge to the upper left will start to drop. If your flip gauge runs out, you'll start to take damage, so flip back before then. Flip back into 2D to build up your flip gauge again. Whoa. That's wild. Okay, so the flip gauge bar replenishes itself as quickly as it diminishes. So you get, it's like one second per bar. Man, that was sick. Well, I should probably farm money as much as I can. Oh, I can't get back. 3D mode. That's so clever. Th okay, wait. This is like somebody like poorly rendering something out in Blender. <laughs> They're like, you know, it works in the front. <laughs> I actually love that mechanic. Defeat enemies to earn points. When you earn enough points, you level up and increase your HP and attack power. Press plus to go to the menu and see how many points you need. Oh, so it is like a, you can actually grind like an RPG? Wait, I kind of like this. Oh, he's so wicked! He had glasses. Secreto, you got a Goomba card. If you collect an enemy's catch card, you boost the damage you do to it. The more cards, the better. You can boost your power by double, triple, or more. Oh, there was a secret item here in 3D mode. Oh. What? Oh, this is really hard to control in 3D. Faith, I lived. Okay, that didn't work. I thought they would be, like, extended out backwards. But they're not. This is a happy flower. For a little while, flowers with coins will rain down. Oh, this is really confusing. Well, okay, there are shadows. One more! One more! What even hit me? Oh, I, I'm in the- I took damage because I'm here for too long. Er. Leap of faith? No, just kidding. Wait! Oh. 
This is so cool. Oh my god, I love that so much. You know, the devs are really cooking. Stop! That guy takes four hits. So it's like the large Goombas. You got a dried shrimp. A dried shrimp restores 1 HP and cures poison. Press level 2 when you're on a jump platform to jump even higher. Oh, Link. <laughs> Wait, secret? These are pal pills. Little pals will follow you and damage any enemy they hit. Get them, boys. Oh, so it's kind of like a shield. You got a fire burst. Royals enemies with searing flames. Level up! Your max HP went up by 5. If I'm only at 15 HP, like, my max has got to be like 100. Minimum. I I'm just grinding here. I don't mind if I lose HP. I mean, not grinding, I'm leveling. Clean. Okay, not so clean. One more. You got a fresh veggie. A crunchy veggie that restores 10 HP and cures poison. Okay, I'm gonna get out of here. Go watch this. Oh, come on. <laughs> you stun like. Oh. I was supposed to go through here. I didn't mean to swear. I just got upset. Watch this. Okay, huh. watch this. Okay, I was shaking the remote. That's not how it works. I'm so used to playing Super Mario Brothers on the Wii. Because when you shake, you get a spin jump. Is a mega star. Use it to grow to mega proportions and trample your enemies. Oh, 
Holy! That was sick. Another one? End of chapter. Did I get a heart? And so, Mario came to learn the stupendous ability of flipping between dimensions. But there was no time to celebrate. Mario still had a pure heart to find. The trail ahead was overrun with savage beasts. Follow me, Tippy said, as she flew toward the mountain that loomed ahead. The pure heart was hidden somewhere on the other side. Chapter 1-2 A Foot in the Foothills So every sub part of the chapter is like a level in a larger world. I feel that the pure heart is beyond this mountain, but it's still far, far away. Something tells me you'll need to put that new skill of yours to use. Mount Lineland. Oh, we don't regain HP at the start of a level. Get him! Sounds like a 2D panel system. Weird. This reminds me of that one episode of Futurama where it's like them going between two different like 2 and 3D dimensions. But it's a whole video game. I remember my teacher showed us that in our art class, when we were learning about 3D shape and form. You say correcto! to the end, though. That was cool. That's what I love a lot about RPGs games, is they get rewarded when you explore. Also, guys, we are another 30 minutes in the stream, so if you're new here, click the follow button. You get cool emotes and you get to type in chat. And if you're already following, make sure notifications are turned on, that way you don't miss a single stream. See if there's more coins. Oh, 
Oh, I have to go this way. Ukulean! Oh, no! That works. Oh, but what? Just in time. I'm a gamer. And Shadio? I can't believe they made this whole game out of paper. Isn't that crazy? It's just like the Kirby Epic Yarn. It's all crochet. You know, Nintendo knows what they're doing. Bridge closed. Red the bridge match. Bridge master. Oh. You know what's wild? I praised Super Mario Wonder so much for having a mechanic where you get to explore the background and the foreground. I should have just played Paper Mario. Why is my score sweating? Oh, something is just leaking in the house. It won't budge. Sir. Hey, hey! You can see me! This is unbelievable! I've been freaking on here for days and finally someone sees me! A couple mornings ago, I rolled out of the wrong side of the bed. And once I got my coffee, I realized I'm stuck in some freaky parallel dimension. I've been hollering and flailing for days, but nobody can hear me or even see me. Just when I was starting to think I'd be here forever, I see you! You just blipped in here out of thin air. I was thinking, if you can do that, maybe I can hitch a ride back with you. Just stand next to me and flip back to 2D. I'll hold on. You gotta help me out of here. This 3D thing just ain't right. I'm thinking that if you flip back to 2D when I'm close to you, I'll hunt you along. I just gotta grab on and cling for life while you flip back, okay? Huh, you did it. I'm back to normal. Listen up, you really bailed me out of here. That 3D business was freaking me out. The name's Red. Nice to meet you. Wait, getting freaked out by 3D? That sounds like the guys who have anime waifus. Moving on. Say, uh, anyway I can repeat ya. Actually, there is one thing. There's a huge chasm outside that we need to cross. So you wanna cross the chasm, huh? Well, you found yourself the right guy. But hey, I gotta warm up. You know, this place is called Impasse Pass, right? I'm only allowed to let a choice few cross the bridge. It's in my job description. I mean, that's why they pay me to stay here. You sure you want to pass? Yeah, well, you did save me from being trapped in a parallel dimension and all. Okay, I'm gonna ask you a question. Get the right answer and I'll let you pass. Sound good? Here we go. What's the most? What's the most male color in the entire universe? Red or green? Red, cause he's wearing red. Yes, you are so right. I knew it, you and me, we see eye to eye on fashion. I'll throw the bridge down, hang on a sec. Oh, your red is so strong. I couldn't even pull that lever. It's like Polybridge. All right, you should be good to go. You take her easy. Thank you, Red.
Hey, stranger. Where'd you blow in from? I'm gonna sound weird if I'm wrong here, but... Are you the legendary hero? You are? <laughs> okay. I got three pointers I'm supposed to pass on to you. Ready? One. In trouble? Flip. Two. Something suspicious? Flip. Three. Feeling saucy? Flip. And there you go. Now you know. All you gotta do is flip everything and everyone off. Gotta pause? I just heard this juicy rumor. Apparently this hero knows a secret dimensional technique. Yeah. He uses it to flip to another dimension and find loads of interesting things. These blocks in my right might not look like much now, but if I were the hero, I might find if I were the hero, I might find some secret stuff behind them. And when you see coins, you can use the technique to like make more of them. If you see the hero, be sure to tell them I'd give it a try. Ooh, secreto. <laughs> I'm in the water. <laughs> so cool. Oh, are you a traveler? If so, are you carrying enough items to restore HP? You can buy more at Houses Shop here in the Old Town. You can even hold on to any extra items you don't want to hike around with. Okay, I'll explore the buildings here and then move on. Good day! items goodness I don't need anything usually my strap for RPGs is just buy a boatload of heals because I'm not good at combat but I'm gonna wait to buy anything because I don't I already pick up stuff randomly so I think I should be okay But every time I buy something, I get store credit. I am such a sucker for rewards programs. As long as I don't have to give, like, super personal information, I'll do it. <laughs> Thousands of years ago, a super advanced civilization lived in this area. We call them the Tribe of Ancients. I guess they built this town too. The mayor says there are secret tunnels and rooms in this town that they built. Look around real closely. You never know when there's a secret around the corner. Hmm. Around this corner, mayhaps? He's a liar and a fraud. Are those bathroom stalls?
Going into 3D mode seems like such a hack. supposed to be here yet. Weird. It. What do you want? Get off my rug! Actually, we were hoping to pass through a town. Oh, nothing but desert past here. There's treasure, but you'll get grit in your grunders! That's what here is for, you old town. Keeps the treasure safe for you. Watch it! Can't let you pass. See this little guy in my pocket? <laughs> He's got something to tell you. Know what he says. Watch it. So give it up. Was it? Was it? You're the hero. Dumplings. If you were, you'd have a pixel that's shaped like an end. I might believe you're the hero if you have one, but you don't. See this beard here? It's got something to tell you. Know what it says. Watch it. This guy's weird. I think he showed me his pee pee. <laughs> Secreto! You got a Boomboxer card! Hi, child. Hey, did you hear? There's a... There's talk of renaming the old town to Heroesburg! It's all because of this legend that the heroes will visit this town after saving the world. The heroes are coming here! Can you believe it? Maybe we should put a sign... Oops, that was an accident. I didn't mean to warp in front of you, child. No crossing, green bridge over seer. I bet you guys five bucks that the green guy is trapped and I have to tell him his favorite color or the strongest color is green. Oh, he's not trapped. Hey, uh, Mr. Redshirt. You want me to flip the bridge down for you? Can't do that. Nope. You need special permission from high up. It's the law. No way I'm... No way am I doing hard time. You need the okay from old man. Watch it. Good luck with that. That old old timer is more crab than man. I needed something that was shaped like a pexel. A hand pexel. Sometimes it may seem like there's nothing of interest in an area, but don't give up. You can always try flipping or using my unique power to investigate an area. I need a hand-shaped tool. Oh, I, I didn't mean to go in there. Oh! 
I lived. Store? Oh, like storage. I'm going back to see if I missed any secrets. be in the town somewhere. Shaped like a hand. If you want to go farther, just look at my brother. His house is on the other side of town up ahead. Ask him about it. That's Chaz. He's a very self-assured young man. He's a friend of Red's and they often play cards together. Chaz always wins. He might want to lose on purpose once in a while. This is Sipsy. She's known as the town gossip. She's always the first to know about anything juicy that happens in town. Oops, wrong button. That is a vacant house. It looks like nobody lives there. That's Babs. 
a young village girl who loves to shop. She's also very helpful. Who knows what the mayor would do without her? That's old man Watchet. He's the crockety mayor of the old town. He's a descendant of the tribe of ancients. He also talks to his beard and cane and stays current with the latest gadgets. I'm gonna talk to him again. The hero is supposed to have a pixel that's shaped like a hand. You got nothing. If you have that pixel, I might believe you're the hero, but you don't, so watch it. Wanna pass? Get off my rug and get yourself a handy looking pixel. What's a pixel? I can't jump in his cupboard. I might have to look this up. I have no clue what the Pexel is. Oh, wait, wait. It's probably to the right. I don't think I can jump over the house. That didn't work. This looks like Bob Tropica. Controversial? I think Pop 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 Tropica is dumb. A hand shaped item? Okay, the only room that I don't know what's going on is the center room. There's another building after this one. Around the corner. Yeah, I can't go behind any of these buildings. about this room that's a thwomp a huge stone monster that lives to squish. You can't beat it. You can only avoid it. It may look impossible to avoid, but I'm sure Mario could find a way. How little does she know? I'm super quick. <laughs> That's one way. I forgot that the fairy can hide 
can find hidden things too. Why didn't I notice the star in the wall? Oh. A hidden door. Now we should be able to get somewhere. A baby game. I can't even beat a stupid baby game. Oh. We're in jail! No! Oh no. The door. Now we're locked inside. No! A cab. Sweet freedom! Wait a moment. If I have been set free, the legendary hero must have done it. I expressed concern when the ancients stuffed me in that chest 1,500 years ago. But it seems my fears were quite unfounded. The hero has finally arrived! Are you... a pixel? Oh! Why, yes, I am the pixel. The name is Thorio. You are a pixel as well. But you don't look familiar. Are you a newer model? I... well... I... um... No matter. Details do bore me. What is important is not the fact that I waited ages to learn this skill. What is important is the fact that I have waited ages to lend my skill to the hero. And glorious day, here you are. Do take me with you. You simply must. You will then smashing. The throwing pixel, Thorio, has joined you. Use them to pick up and throw objects and enemies. You can even throw while you jump. With me at your side, one may grasp objects with great vigor. Simply press one to use my throwing ability. What's this one you say? You need not worry. The great being that watches us will know what it is. Just remember that I can grasp objects and enemies and hurl them with gusto. Grab something with one and press one again to throw it. Why not take a moment to get acquainted with my useful talent? You will need to use my ability to get out of this room. Ready? Steady? Go! Wait, I got it. I don't got it. <laughs> Wait, I'm in the box. Am I? I'm not doing this right, I don't think. I'm annoyed. You know who else is going to be annoyed? The non-subs. Because you know what? We're two hours in the stream. So it's time for me to run some ads. So you can avoid the ad by subscribing for $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long. Or you can link your Amazon Prime to Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe, see if you got a sub available. And if you're new here, follow. We've already gotten one follower today. Can we hit our daily goal? Get some water, get a snack. I'll see some of you guys in a few. Also, gonna verify that the IO is still synced. The audio keeps desyncing. I don't know what is triggering it.
It's probably OBS. Hmm. Upload current log file. Analyze. Yeah, it says it's an issue with OBS. Hmm. The only way to fix it if I, is if I restart stream, which is annoying. You know what? How about we try that? Guys, you have to promise to stay in chat. Okay, I'm going to restart the stream. Got it? Got it? <laughs> 